Hello, I'm Edward Tarch, math teacher. This is another in my series of solution videos to some of my math challenges. The math challenge for this solution video is my Pentagon and Triangles challenge. And here is how I presented that challenge in the original video. We have here a regular pentagon outlined in red. That word regular implies that all five sides of the pentagon have the same length. Built on those five sides, we have five triangles. Each triangle has as one of its sides one of the sides of the pentagon. We have here ten black line segments, and all ten of them are the same length. The total area of the five triangles is 600 square units. The total perimeter of the figure outlined in black is 170 units. The perimeter of the Pentagon, outlined in red, is a counting number. That is, it's a number from the set 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and so on indefinitely. And also, each triangle's altitude drawn to the red side is a counting number. And my question is, what is the perimeter of the Pentagon? Here's my solution. Since the total area of the five triangles is 600 square units, we can divide that by five and get as the area of one triangle 120 square units. And since the total length of the 10 black segments is 170 units, we can divide that by 10 and get each of those lengths to be 17 units. This represents one of those triangles its area is 120, and each of the black sides has length 17. We can use the Pythagorean equation for right triangles, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, to try to find this length, half the red length, and the height of the triangle, because those two and the hypotenuse 17 make a right triangle, which fits the Pythagorean equation. We can make a table of square numbers beginning 1 squared equals 1, 2 squared equals 4, 3 squared equals 9, 4 squared equals 16, and so on, down to 17 squared, and look for what we call a Pythagorean triple, that is, three numbers that satisfy the Pythagorean equation. Once we get that table and look through it, we will find that 8 squared plus 15 squared equals 17 squared. That is 64 plus 225 equals 289. That means we can consider 8 as this length and 15 as that length. That works because the area of a triangle is one half the base times the height, and here we have one half the base, 8, that's half the base, and the height 15, and 8 times 15 is 120. So that works. But the 8 and the 15 are interchangeable, so we could have the 15 here and the 8 here. That also works. Again, these triangles are not drawn to scale. In this case, the red length is 16. In this case, the red length is 30. I asked for the perimeter of the pentagon, it takes five of these to make that perimeter. So in this case, the perimeter is 16 times 5, which is 80. In this case, the perimeter is 30 times 5, which is 150. And so there are two solutions. The perimeter of the Pentagon can be either 80 units or 150 units. And that is my solution to my Pentagon and Triangles challenge. Thank you for watching this solution video.